Hi, my name is Filipe and I am from Brazil. Hi, my name is Haruka and I'm from Japan. Hi everyone, my name is Jan and I'm from Germany. Bienvenue à Libreville. After nearly nine months in the Southern Hemisphere, crew members were excited to cross the equator and arrive in Libreville, the capital of Gabon, and the country's largest city. The guest of honor, Gabon's first deputy prime minister for health, warmly welcomed the ship and opened the book fair to the public. With only five full days in Gabon, the crew members worked really hard to make the most of the short visit. And one of the highlights for the visitors was the opportunity to attend to one of the six events held on board. A youth event called Courageous, a pastor's gathering, and a night of prayer for nations around the world challenged the local community to have a faith that defies the boundaries of stereotypes, denominations, and country lines. A faith that makes a difference not only in their own life, but also in the community around them. 70% of the people attend to Sunday services, and we realize how passionate the Gabonese people are for praying for their own country. So in the event Prayer for the Nations, we challenge them to care not only about the needs of their own country, but for other nations as well. During the program, eight young ladies from the ship's crew, each from different countries, shared current challenges that their country is facing and asked for prayer on specific issues. Participants were then given the opportunity to join one of these crew members to lift their country up in prayer. The goal of the night um, is to encourage the Gabonese to pray for different nations and they gather together to pray for my nation. Uh, it was the first time I experienced um, people praying for my nation and they were so passionate and on fire for our country. So one of the guys was even kneeling down praying. So I was really touched at the moment and I actually cried. So I really thank God for this opportunity to pray with the locals in Gabon. The night was a unique experience for all involved and an encouragement for both crew members and participants to stand as one for the needs of others around the world. In addition to the onboard events, we have many teams leaving the ship and going for outreaches in different places of the city and the local communities. One group of crew members worked with locals to repaint a school that had not been painted in several years, and another team visited an orphanage where they worked to patch a leaking roof. Other teams were sent to poverty-stricken villages where they provided hygiene training and gave out toiletry packs to the children. Even though our time in Gabor was short, we were very encouraged by how the ship's visit impacted individuals as well as communities here. We are so thankful to our committee, to the volunteers, and to all supporters around the world who made this visit possible to Gabon. Thank you very much for praying for the visit to Gabon. And please continue to pray for us as we sail to the, our next African port.